I uh, Facebook or YouTube or any um, anywhere this ends up. Um, I was going to do a shaving video for a friend. I don't know if I should somehow position the camera closer to my face. I think you can pretty much tell I'm in need of a shave. And, you know, I'm a little bit conflicted. I had a beard for a very long time, in, in case you don't know. But, um, so, um, I basically don't really know how to shave that well. And, uh, my mom is very supportive, uh, just in general. Um, but, uh, in addition to being supportive in general, she, uh, she got me some fancy razors, disposable razors. I, uh, I, I started off when I first uh, trimmed or shaved my, my beard. I went to the dollar store, or um, it's called the Dollarama, so it's priced between one and three dollars uh, per item. Um, or well, actually to be, to, to be accurate, um, sometimes they have like two, 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 like if it's a shot glass or something, I, I don't know, like something small, it might be something like two for one dollar or sometimes even three for one dollar. Um, anyways, uh, who cares about that? Sorry. My head is itchy. I've been wearing a hat all the time. I used to wear a hat when I was younger. A baseball hat. Uh, when the Blue Jays, Toronto. I'm from Toronto. Hi. Uh, okay, so yeah, um, I was thinking of making a shaving video specifically for one person. Uh, for whatever reason. Um, you know, to boost morale, um, but this will just be a shaving video, um, for everybody, um, or anyone who wants to see me shave. Um, you may, you may be asking yourself or, uh, yelling at the computer screen, um, why is this insane man making a video about uh, shaving? Is he insane? Yeah, well, yeah, hopefully you know me well enough to know that yes, I am insane. But, uh, despite my insanity, what I'm doing here is not insane. There are people on YouTube, Facebook, you know, all that stuff, Twitter, I, I don't know. They just, can I just talk a, a brief side note. Um, I have a girlfriend and she's one year and eight months younger than me. I'm 32 so she's, uh, she will be turning 31. Um, and uh, anyways, um, she has a younger sister and her younger sister is on basically the next gen of social media and I, I'm I, she, uh, so my girlfriend told me I can tell you what it is and I was like no I, I don't I don't really want to I don't want to like whether it's successful or not like I'm, I'm I have no doubt it could I, I have no doubt like fa Facebook for kids or whatever, <laughs> like it, I'm sure it's, I'm sure it could be very big and popular and maybe even it, in a few years I'll join it and I'll be the old timer, like when I, like 2008, whenever, when I joined Facebook and my older family members joined and I'm like, hey, get out of here, this is for us. So I'll be that guy, um, to them. Um, anyways, I, yeah, I don't care. 
<laughs> I have enough social media. I, I, I have a Tumblr. I think that's like... Tumblr, I'm 32, like, um, Tumblr is just like, you know, that's far enough. But, like, uh, I have Google, uh, on the other hand, I have uh, Google Plus. I have Google Plus and Google Play and Gmail and blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I'm into Google. Um, and, like, Google Plus really, um, is underpopulated, or I just don't know the right people, but I maintain an account there. Um, maybe someday it will blossom into something. I don't, you know, I don't mean to disrespect Google Plus. I really like Google Plus. Um, I don't get much feedback. I do, I, I do get some. Um, and Google Plus is tied in with uh, the other Google stuff, so blah, blah, blah. It's just like, it's, it's all a trick. <laughs> Wake up, sheep, oh, it's all a trick. Uh, um, or, you know, um, or what, what, you call it a trap. Um, yeah, whatever, I don't know. I don't, I, I, I can't claim to know, I don't know. So anyways, I'm going to shave my face. And, um, so, I've got this, um, Life Brand, which is a fairly generic brand. It's not, like, sexy. Or my girlfriend was really against, um, me using that product, uh, the Axe. Um, but I own it. It was, I think a church gave it to me. And I'm not going to say anything bad about churches. Churches, like, they're good people. I, I don't know. I, I'm mentally ill. Leave me alone. <laughs> <coughs> so this is a shaving video. Um, so this is also Life Brand. And... Um, these are disposable razors. As I said, my mom is very generous in helping me out, making me look a bit better. Um, you know, it's, it's, you know, I, I don't know. Yeah, like, you can't really deny that the people who have power, like if, in, I don't know. You can't really d deny that men who have the appearance that I have wear business suits and very seldom do they have beards. Most of them shave. So basically I'm just fitting in and you know, like, I don't care, <laughs> you know, like, I need it. I I have the feeling that I need a job. I don't know if that's based in reality. You, you know, a lot of you are saying, "What's he talking about? He maybe he doesn't need a job." Um. Uh, I don't know. I'm fucking crazy, and it's late. It's uh, it's not that late. It's f four minutes past midnight. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't feel like explaining that. Anyway, so, um, I have to get this off. Uh, I don't know the best way how to do it. This little plastic that protects the razor. There we go. So this has, it appears to have two blades. But I guess they're good blades. Anyways, I wanted to mention that because, so, because, um, my mom bought me these disposable razors, um, that have five blades. And when I shaved as a teenager, um, 
I, uh, I thought two blades was like the lot of blades, or no, two blades was normal, and then three blades was like, oh, fancy pants. Um, so, yeah, now they're up to five. And I don't know, you know, like maybe, I, I think a lot of people probably use these things more than once and there's probably people who will tell you you're supposed to use it more than once, but a disposable razor is a disposable razor. And I'm not really get when I'm shaving. See, this is before. Uh, okay, so when I'm shaving, um, it's just like I don't get that. I don't get that. You know, Republican, conservative, uh, neo-conservative shave that you need for a job. <laughs> I, that was just a joke and I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, so um, let's get down to business. I, uh, I've got this thing, it has a nozzle. So you push down on the top and the cream comes out. Don't make jokes. Don't make jokes. Here's the cream. And then you just like kind of, I guess I'm using the camera as a mirror. Because I have a fancy camera where I can see myself while I record myself. Uh, it's 2016. Leave it alone. I'm sure you. Half, like 90% of you are going like, yeah, no duck, you can see yourself with your camera. Everyone can, everyone has that kind of camera. And then like 10% or maybe 1% of you are like, I don't know. Is there anyone like, you know, I don't know. Maybe in a different country or Oh, and now I'm all obsessed with my privilege and how I'm a sinner because I have privilege. Okay. La la la. By the way, American Psycho um, is on sale on Google Play. Um, just, just putting that out there. It's a joke. I'm a comedian. Oh, mm -mm. or I was a comedian, or I am, or I will be a comedian, I don't know. Where do you draw the line? Draw it. Line has to be drawn. Okay, so I should have brought a rag with me. What is this down here? This is... A dirty paper towel that was on my floor. So I'll wipe the extra um, shaving cream onto this dirty paper towel that was on my floor. So I'm bur I, I've got a bit of indigestion because I ate a hot dog. Um, but come on, not everything's a joke. Okay, so. Or, yeah. Um, uh, da, da, da. And we have a razor. And I want to get this guy closer to me. Okay. So what am I going to do? Duck down? Hmm. Hmm. I really should be doing this at, at, at the sink. 
this. Tell me in the comments what I'm doing wrong. Because I know I'm doing something wrong. Uh, 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 happy, 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 happy shave. You see, if I was doing this in front of the mirror, I wouldn't have to make up songs about shaving while I shaved myself and potentially cut my tongue off or like, yeah. That's not an American psycho shave. Mate's bleeding too? No, I don't see any blood. Okay. This will be the best shaving video you'll ever see. I, I've been listening to a bit of, bit of rap music, so I have to call myself the best and the greatest, and um, rest in peace, I don't know, I'm not even going to bring him up, someone died recently, you're probably re watching this two years from now, and you probably don't care about some guy who died a few years ago. Just that's how it goes, and um, uh, I didn't really know this. It's a celebrity. I don't. I don't need to have a personal connection with all the celebrities of the world. I'm sorry, and I'm sure he was a great guy. I just. I'm sorry but I'm not going to use his name because, um, <coughs> I smoke in my room. So I just wiped some of the foam off the razor onto this dirty t-shirt that was on my floor. I'm going to put the dirty t-shirt back on the floor. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Will you give me a dollar for a dollar's worth of dollar? Will you give me a dollar so I can buy a cola? Coca-Cola. Did I forget to foam up my neck? Oh, this is shameful. <laughs> We all love each other. We all love me. Everybody loves me. I'm disgusted by myself. And I say that because it's a funny thing to say. It's funny to say you hate yourself and that you're disgusted by yourself. <coughs> Hmm. Some of the older people might not know this, but it's true. It's, it's very funny when you say you're disgusting and ugly and, uh, hmm. Do, do, do. 
See, I got this joke book from 1908 or something like that, maybe even older. It was like a 300 or 500 page book full of jokes from that time period. And it billed itself as the most funny, the, the best collection of jokes from that time period. And not only were the jokes not funny, they uh, they actually did not make any sense. They were just like, they made as, you could have taken off the page that said it was a joke book, and you could have replaced it with a title that said, Writings of an Inmate inmate of an insane asylum, which I can say because I have been there many times. Ha ha! Mm -hmm. Not only have I been an inmate of an insane asylum, I have written insane things while in an in in insane asylum. They call it, they, they have different words for it now, but, um, so I am privileged to be able to make fun of the insane. And, uh, no, <laughs> no one has any privilege to do anything, or, I don't know. It's like, privileged to drink water. <laughs> hmm. And I really hope I don't turn you off when I talk like that. It's just, I'm not being reactionary. I'm not really into politics that much. Um, I guess it's like the Simpsons where Homer shaves his beard and it pops back immediately. Um, the funny scene in the Simpsons. Um, I think that was the Babysitter Bandit episode, if you want to look that up. Um, So Christopher Hitchens, I guess we're done shaving. I'm just going to put this aside for now. Christopher Hitchens was what someone to call an atheist, and he called himself an anti-theist. And that he, st he said even if God existed, he would not want to... Um, uh, even if you could prove God existed, he would not want to be the subject to God. Um, because he said, according to what the Bible says about God, uh, um, that God's not a good person. That's what Christopher Hitchens said. And um, my girlfriend... Uh, uh, she said, um, you know, Christopher Hitchens died of throat cancer, and, uh, do you think he died of, uh, do you think he died of th throat cancer because he kept saying bad things about God, like God cursed him? And I, I had to say no. Christopher Hitchens drank and smoked all the time, <laughs> and, and, and his dad had throat cancer, 
and uh, like uh, so anyways I coughed a lot because I smoke I need to quit smoking thank you my friends for watching my funny video uh, of uh, shaving my beard I hope it was funny and informative bless you all Will that save me from cancer? I don't know.